Hola, hola guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Roxanne. If it's your first time here, then welcome. In one of my previous videos, I talked about possibly talking about and showing you guys some of the bookmarks that I use, and some of you guys were interested in that, so I thought, hey, why not? Let's talk about the bookmarks that I have. Now, these are not all of the bookmarks that I think I have. I just, these are just the ones that I have been able to locate. Every now and then I'll open a book and one will fall out, and I'm like, oh, I had that bookmark. There, there's where that is um, so yeah I mean I'm sure that somewhere in these books there are more bookmarks which is these are the ones that I've that I know where they're located and hence the ones that I use the most um, and yeah some of these have like really random stories so I'll talk to you guys about them some that do not and just are random picks that I have found um, are this one I just like it because it's uh, it reminded me of me and it reminded me of my glasses because they look almost identical except mine don't have these little thingies on the side but yeah it's a book nerd i got this one at books a million and i'm surprised that it still has this because any bookmark that i have found that has this has no longer has it because my cat likes to play with these and get rid of them case in point this one this one says it says turn your face to the sun and the shadows fall behind you a maori proverb i think it just got it because it was pretty and black and gold and i like the color combination uh, i think i probably got this one at a barnes and noble but it had the tassels and it does not anymore another one that had tassels and does not have any anymore is this one which has a Dumbledore on it um, now I had an entire like series of these I got a whole group of these this was back when in back when the now Disney Springs was called downtown Disney had the Virgin Mega Store. that's where I got these and I had this one I had the trio I had like Sirius Black I had a bunch of these that came like together and yeah it had a tassel I, like it had a longer tassel but Galileo trued through that so it no longer has that and yeah I mean I lost every single other one except Dumbledore which sucks because Dumbledore isn't my favorite but whatever it works so I like many people went through all the huge like Hunger Games phase my neighbors I guess are coming home I went through a huge Hunger Games phase and okay I went to books I went to like the bookstore or something like that and they had a bunch of Hunger Games merch and my intention was to get a Katniss bookmark somehow I grabbed a Gale bookmark and somehow I didn't notice that it was a Gale bookmark until I got home. And by then I was like, oh, I'm not gonna go back to the bookstore to exchange this. So I've had it. I barely use it to be honest, um, but I still have it. And it was supposed to be Katniss, but it's not. Yeah. Um, oh, just a quick fact about me. I do not like to exchange things. I get like really weirdly nervous about going back to the store and exchanging things or returning things so I just I, I don't I went through like a big Simpsons phase and I just happened to be at the bookstore and they had a Marge one it's one of these that you can flip upside down and it'll say Marge both ways um, and it has her both ways and yeah this was 195 so not too bad the Simpsons. I don't really watch The Simpsons anymore. I got this one for my book, first ever book depository order. I was really excited to get it. Yeah. Oh, I think I was supposed to get one. I think I had one from when I went to Shakespeare and Company in New York. Don't know where that is. And I showed you guys the one that I got. Hold on. The one that I got when I got this Pride and Prejudice edition, which is super pretty. So that's this one. And it says at the back that it is a 9 out of 10 that have been designed by customers. So I don't know if they're trying to entice me to buy more so I can collect them all. It might be working because I already ordered. I, <laughs> I put in an order that I actually 
another one that I had a lot of and now I only have one is this one I also I believe I also got this one at the Virgin Mega Store, and this one came with a set it was a set of four so it was the four houses and now I only have Ravenclaw I mean it's really pretty oh you know what I think these might be in my books actually because I think that's what I did I think I got like four of I had the four of these and then I put them where I thought like Ravenclaw made an impact and then I would put it in that book like I would probably put this maybe in the last one because they talk about the diadem I would have probably put Gryffindor in the first one because that's when he gets sorted I would probably put Slytherin in the second book because of the Chamber of Secrets I did so they're probably somewhere in my books but this is the only one that I have to show you. <laughs> and then there was this uh, like special thing going on in Books A Million and they had a bunch of these really thick kind of like cardboardy ones. And I got three and then I realized I don't really like them because they're so thick that it's weird to actually close the book afterwards. So I mean I have them but I don't really use them. This one which is called I am sim not called it just says I am simply a book drunkard and if you can tell it has been bitten by my cat I have this one that says if I had a single flower for every time I think of you I could walk forever in my garden it's that one I have because of course I says in vain I have struggled it will not do my feelings will not be repressed you must allow me to tell you how ardently I admire and love you oh sweet Darcy so that's this one and then this one I had to get because obviously and I like it so much and I'm afraid that I'm gonna break it so I've kept it in its in its packaging like it's Kind of protector but it's this super cute one with cats look at it oh and then this one sort of looks like galileo except galileo doesn't have white on his paws and he just has he has a much smaller white patch on his on his like chest okay <laughs> so cute then um the last ones are also a pack that i got and they are these cute little magnet ones so they come like this and then i'm sure you guys have seen a lot of these before so they open and they're a magnet and then you pinch some pages in between and then like that and this is was also a set of i believe four and now now, now i am down to just three so i have harry I have a blonde, very blonde Hermione. And I have Malfoy. They're super cute. And I actually got these at Target and I think they're still selling them at Target. I was at Target a couple of days ago and they still had them and it's in their book section next to where they sell the Harry Potter books, which is in their like young adult section. And you can get those and they also have four each one with the houses and that one isn't cartoony like these are the houses are they kind of look like if you imagine just this very very small and in a magnet that's what they look like and they were i don't think they were super expensive but yeah these are just the bookmarks that i own um if i acquire any any new ones any good ones i will show you probably in in future book hauls hopefully i get another really pretty one with my new uh with with the book depository order that i put in today so yeah let me know what kind of bookmarks you guys like to use uh i also use like receipts and like whatever literally is on my wrist i'll use i've used anything like really anything that's around um so yeah i hope this was enjoyable and fun as always i love and appreciate you guys thank you for watching and for listening have a good one